arrived in Gilly Tea and we are just walking to the hotel. It's taken like 35 minutes. Our tour guide has um, said we're gonna walk, do a walking tour, but yeah. Um, I'll update you when we're arriving. Not really been a walking tour, no. but you know. Not really, he's not telling us anything. We basically just toured ourselves, me and Sam. <laughs> Thinking, yes. what's that hotel? And looking at the palm trees. <laughs> hot guys. Hot, hot. It is boiling. I think it's one of the hottest days today. I don't know if it's because we're walking, but it felt hot in the morning. Even at like 8 a.m. It was hot. This is the other side of the island. Up here. You can see sea, sand, luxury. Look at this bike. That is the oldest bike I've ever seen. So we're just about to arrive at the hotel um, and yeah, it is really nice to get us so I'm excited to explore. I'm not really sure why there's massive puddles unless it's actually been raining but I thought it would just dry out in the sand so that's a bit confusing but yeah, we're nearly at the hotel so I'll let you know when we checked. What's this loaded for? <laughs> So guys, this is our hotel room. We're all very sweaty from the walk, but I wanted to film anyway. So here's me. Hello. We've got, oh, we've got shower cups, comb, soap, sewing kit, What's that? shampoo, shower gel. Got, it. Yeah. got a nice little sink, some wow. towels. Can you see over there? I could, but I was a bit scared. An outside shower. Cute. Which looks like a really good shower head, actually. Toilet. And then this is the inside part. It's nice and cool in here. So obviously that's the outside part. A lot of storage as well. Some hangers. But we don't unpack anyway, so it don't matter. And beds, which look like three-quarter beds, I imagine. We've got our own little fridge. At all. Oh, they're giving us tissues, TV, telephone. This is in here. There's no safe though. Here at the pool um, bar and restaurant, that does food and it's very luxurious here. So yeah, I'm just going to chill, sunbathe, and swim. We're just chilling at the beach. It's about half Hi. five o'clock. We're just chilling at the beach, everyone. Yeah. And um, this is a private beach. It's a private beach, but it's not really. Though, For the is pool? It? Huh? For the hotel? Yeah, but it's not really, is it? Um, because there's just loads of people on it anyway. But we just took photos in that swing over there. Yeah. Yeah. Hello. Hello. We're getting all the Hello. Hello. Oh my god. Thank you. Let's see ya. Sorry, I didn't actually explain what was going on for like hours. Basically, I FaceTimed my best friend on the beach, which was nice for like nearly an hour actually. <laughs> and then we just um, came back, got ready, um, and this outside shower was literally amazing. It's such better quality than mine at home, I think. <laughs> so yeah, I was loving being in there for a while. And now we've got ready, we're in this red dress and we're about to go for dinner and meet the others because hannah was attending a wedding on a live stream so that's why we're delayed but yeah um so we're gonna do that and then i'll let you go what do you mean everyone i'm not feeling amazing today just because i ate some dodgy chicken with bones and yeah when i was eating it i ate like four pieces but still it's given me a bad summer feeling sick so yeah we need to go to the pharmacy later but on a positive note we're going snorkeling so the water might actually help me like so i'll be like a fish <laughs> hannah's got a gopro uh -huh. see i do my one broke because i bought a cheap one so i can bring it on this trip but i want to get another one soon i might get an actual proper one there it is and we're just waiting to get on the boat now um, to go. Where are we actually going to? Like another beach just north? Ooh, or are we just getting off the boat and snorkeling? I think we're just getting off the boat and snorkeling. So yeah, 
um, it should be fun. Obviously, I won't be able um, to film anything right now, but Hannah is going to send me the clips when she's home. Hello, Hello. 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 Now we're going back to the hotel and we're just staying there for a bit and then we're going to rent some bikes and go around the island. So yeah. So we're just on a bike ride. Woo! And yeah, we're just cycling um, to brunch place that I'll show you when we get there. Sorry I didn't feel much yesterday, I was feeling a bit ill. Um, and yeah, I just go to the toilet like 100 million times a day. So I didn't really want to film them, but um, I'll film more today. Hannah riding her bicycle. So <laughs> <laughs> this cute breakfast place called Hello Cortina and it's got really cute decor and very cute. I ordered a smoothie bowl, ice chai latte and orange juice and it's really thirsty. Yeah. So I'll see you when we get the food. My smoothie bowl looks incredible. Mine's all gone. Hannah's is not looking great. <laughs> Was it good though? Was it good? Oh no, you can't put that on. I have to cut that out. Because I think smoothie bowl guys. Wow. with me. So we're just horse riding. So everyone, a bit of an update. We um, left the beach after like two, three hours, cycled back, and we went on a horse ride, Hannah and I, and some of the other girls. Um, so there was like one, two, three, four, like six, seven of us all together. Um, but the horse was a bit wild, to be fair, because um, basically they just don't train them here, and they're just like wild either they like ride on the beach they were these own man's horses two of them but then we're not sure about the others and i so one girl got off it because she couldn't control the galloping and she also faint felt a bit faint so i hopped on thinking oh we'll be all right and literally i can ride as well and it galloped into a tree so they're just like crazy um at least i didn't fall off or it didn't like buckle rear um <laughs> but yeah bit wild for my liking 
Um, also a bit of a disappointment because we paid like the equivalent of like £20 and it was under an hour. We just set off a bit late because there was some confusion of the amount of horses because one was ill so they couldn't bring it. Um, so there was only six horses but seven riders. But all in all it was a really nice beach sunset horse ride. And I've just got ready for dinner. I'll show you what I'm wearing actually because I bought this dress in... Um, where did I buy it in Lombok and it was only like equivalent of £17 which is amazing and it's like amazing quality I'm having a bit of trouble with the straps because I feel like they're a bit they like full but um, it's just like a long sort of um, maxi what it cuts off around like there and it's a bit longer at the back but I really love it this is what it looks like from a distance. I can't really get the full thing in. And that's what it looks like from the back. So it's got like this tie detail. And yeah, it's just really cute. So I'd wear my hair up tonight to show it off. So I just did a bun and like a plait around. So yeah, I am feeling quite fancy tonight. So love it. So, I got seafood spaghetti garlic bread, which looks amazing. And then Hannah's got, <laughs> stop focusing her, three dishes here. Salad, fries, and nasi No, no, nothing. <laughs> She's never eaten nasi garang ever again. <laughs> but we're at the pool area. Breakfast by the pool. No, we're still on the same bubbly tables, so that's what happens when <laughs> Hannah's coffee has had a bit of a spillage. My tea's perfect. <laughs> and I've got boiled eggs this morning. Mm. Yum, yum. Uh, we're just at the horse stables. Hello. Hello. Oh. They're feisty. Ooh. <laughs> oh, yeah, it is back. Hello, Paul. Hello. They're young, aren't they? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Dude, it's what should we call them? Rex. Yeah. Which one? The Rex. Rex. Rexy. <laughs> Rexy. I've just been paddle boarding, which was actually really hard. I could hardly stand up at some points, and then I moved to the kayak, which was so much easier, but only had like five minutes on that. We saw little turtles popping their heads up, but I don't think I got any proper videos, so that's not good. Um, but yeah, we did that, and then now we're just at this tattoo studio place. I'm getting my first tattoo, a bit scared, a bit nervous, but I think I'll be fine. I have quite a high pain threshold, so it should be alright. We just stopped off at this little lunch place. Um, we're just riding our bikes and we just ordered. I've got some fries and a quesadilla and an orange juice. And Hannah's got fries and a salad. So yeah, we're just having a bite to eat and I'm actually getting my tattoo at 3.30 now just because they've got a few bookings but then they're a bit more free. And I was going to get a massage, but I think I'm going to get that when we go back to um, the first place we were at, Semiak. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to wait till then, just because there are only like 60,000 instead of like 100,000 here. And also, we don't have much time today, because we've got our sunset farewell dinner at 5. So we have to go back, get ready, and go to that pretty soon after the tattoo's finished. So yeah, um, but it should be a good evening, saying goodbye to everyone. Um, but also quite sad because we've been with each other for like three weeks now and some of us have made like really good friends and it's really sad <laughs> and yeah but that's what we're doing at the moment it's so hot today and um, I have no other updates so yeah this is my quesadilla I've got some guac sour cream looks really good it's got vegetables and cheese and fries. I mean, I'm just with a nice view. Hannah's lovely salad that's got feta in, which you can't tell, which it didn't say on the menu. No, and feta on. We didn't. <laughs> <laughs> the life of Hannah Copsey. <laughs> All her allergies. We've got Saf here, she is getting 
first ever tattoo. She's very nervous, but she's gonna smash it. How'd you work this camera? It's like a little uh, cat scratch. Absolutely love it. She's already thinking about what's that next one. Do you want a drink? She blows you the fuck around. Says I want you to fucking back.